When you need a source for an assignment, you have thousands of websites, books, articles, essays, and more to choose from. So how do you decide which sources are the best to use? Let the CRAP method help you. CRAP stands for Currency, Relevancy, Authority, Accuracy, and Purpose. When you use these criteria to evaluate a source, you'll get a good idea of if you should use that source or not. So let's talk about the CRAP method. The C stands for currency. You should look at the age of the source and consider if you need more current information for your assignment. Sometimes a source that was published many years ago can be useful. Other times, especially if you're researching a health or technology topic, you may need to get the most recent information possible. The R stands for relevancy. When you find a possible source, consider how that source fits in with your assignment guidelines and if the source supports what you want to say in your paper. If not, keep looking for another source that might be more useful. Also, think about the intended audience for the source. Is it too advanced or too elementary for your purpose? The first A stands for authority. Look at who created the source and consider their background. What do they know about the topic? Do they have training, education, or experience related to the topic? We want to find sources that are created by experts or people who have authority in that area. The second A in CRAP stands for accuracy. You should go through the source you found to see if it contains any inaccuracies or inconsistencies. Does the information in that source agree with the other information you found? If not, it might not be the most trustworthy source to use. Finally, the P stands for purpose. Think about the reason the source was created. Is it to sell ad space? Convince you to buy or do something? Or to entertain? Or is it to share knowledge and research? Do the authors remain unbiased? Ideally, you should use sources that were created without bias to communicate information. If you use the CRAP test on the books, websites, articles, and videos you find as you research, you'll be able to find the best sources possible for your assignment.